Hi everyone, this is Dave from Daily Tech TV with another Q&A session for you. Before I start this Q&A session, I just want to remind you all, please do leave me some new questions in the comments below, or send me an email, geekanoids at gmail.com with tech Q&A in the subject line, or grab my free iOS app in the iTunes App Store. Just search for Geekanoids, totally free, and not only do you get access to all of my content, but you can also send me questions via the app. So this video, we've got a really good question from the Lego Plocoon. That is a really cool name. Hi Dave, since the tablet there hasn't been a major innovation in tech. When and what do you think it will be? Well there are two really exciting technologies for me that I would like to, to see become sort of consumer affordable. One of those is OLED technology, which we've already seen in the likes of mobile phones with their super AMOLED displays and things like this, and they really do produce eye-popping colours and are gorgeous to look at. And we've also heard from the Consumer Electronics Show, we've known about it for a while really, that manufacturers are working on OLED displays and OLED televisions. Now, I've got a 46-inch LED TV and I really look forward to the day when super thin OLED displays of that size are sort of affordable to people like me and you. Um, and it will happen, it will happen. We've seen it with 3D TVs, they started off really high prices and a year later you can pick up a 3D TV for the same price that you would have paid for an LED TV the year before. So OLED display is very exciting for me and I'm really looking forward to those coming down to an affordable price. The other technology that I really like the idea of um, was I saw the, and I'm sure a lot of you have seen this as well, but I saw the demonstration of the window with the display built into it. Um, and it had a lady sort of touching the window and it would electronically draw the blinds so nobody could see into the window. They couldn't see what you were seeing on the display either, which was really good. I, th I think it just sort of blacked it out from the exterior of whatever building you were installing this into. And it also displayed things like weather. Um, it was touch sensitive, so I could see that being used for social networking updates and things like this. And it was a really exciting thing to see because you've seen it in so many of these films where people move things around these screens and it, it's very futuristic. And I think that sort of technology is finally going to become available to us. And I find that really exciting. Now, if memory serves me right, those windows were available. I think they were about 10 or 15,000 pounds. It might have been even more than that as a sort of starting price. So very, very expensive. Um, but again, when that technology filters its way down and becomes readily available, I think it'll be absolutely fantastic. Imagine being able to just touch the window and the blinds electronically draw. Even that alone excites me. Add on all those other bells and whistles where you can get information on your window. Brilliant, absolutely superb. So that's what I think is gonna happen. What do you wanna see? What innovations and new technology do you wanna see come to fruition. It would be really interesting if you could leave me your thoughts below, even if they're far out there and some of us might think they're never going to happen. It would be really interesting just to hear what you guys and girls think. So thanks very much for watching this video. Please do leave me some comments, please leave me some new questions and I will see you all in the next one.